how do you feel about the fact that, like, do, do you like sweet candy still or like non-chocolate candy anymore? Because I don't. I, I don't, I will not eat, I, like even Skittles, I don't really touch anymore. It's only chocolate-based candies that I'll, that I'll go into. But I've completely, like gummies yeah. I won't do, any of that stuff. I've grown out of them. Like I like, I still like red vines. That's like probably the only candy that's not chocolate. Oh, and Reese's Sour Patch Kids. I'm just. I feel like I'm just done with them. I don't know. Like whenever I get anything, I always crave chocolate. I don't crave yeah. anything else at this point in my life. Welcome to another episode of Reckless Even Shorts, aka We Shorts. Matt's eye along with Chuck Rowland. Today we're going to be taking a look at an item that I found at 7-Eleven. This is pineapple habanero gummy candy. Right? Why are they selling this? Who goes to 7-Eleven? And it's the 7-Eleven brand too. Seven Select. Yeah. So, like, who goes like, oh, I would really, really like to have habanero gummy candy from 7-Eleven? Like, what? I mean, maybe it's going to be good, but I don't really understand why they want to. Oh, God, it has a description, too. Oh, oh sure, the habanero pepper looks harmless enough. No, it doesn't. It looks <laughs> terrifying. Uh, it said, small and unassuming, it packs a punch when paired with uh, sweet pineapple flavors. It's a match made in heaven. These, delight, uh, these delights combine exotic flavors... Uh, you will love. Get ready for delicious. I don't trust you, 7-Eleven. Yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I don't trust you. That all sounded made up. It sounded like a person in marketing that doesn't speak like a human being. Yeah. Like, on the back, you know what it should say? It should say, bitch, just eat them. And I go like, all right, well, fair enough. That's how I talk, so 7-Eleven gets me. Yeah, it gets me. <laughs> they need to have candy and food that just talks shit to you. Yeah. Like, a new bit of, bit of crackers comes out. Instead of Ritz, it's like, it's like, just fucking eat these crackers, you little pussy. And I'm like, wow, I'm buying those. I would buy those at a... No lie, I would buy those in a heartbeat. All right, let's go. Okay. Wait a minute. That is actually, like, oddly decent. It tastes like those rings. Yeah, where the hell is the habanero, though? There's no heat to this whatsoever. I'm not getting the habanero. Huh? It tastes like... Old people candy coated in sugar. Yeah. Like, I wouldn't, po like, new me wouldn't eat this. Me that just kind of watches sugar. Old me probably would bait the whole bag because I'm out of boredom. Like, a decent movie theater item, I think. Yeah, maybe. <clears throat> no, see, if not, I was a like, huge them. pineapple fan, then probably, yeah. Uh, where the hell is the heat? And again, you can't. There's no heat at all. You can't call something a pepper and not have any heat. Yeah. It's non existent. It's just pineapple gummy. Yeah, I mean, it's fine. I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna give it a very low three out of five. Um, it's just a barely a step above drunk food. Um, but it's it's still, it's a letdown. It should have had more heat. Yeah, I'm, I'm still giving it a two. It was a big letdown, and you know, not a big fan of pineapple, but it was a okay for a candy. Oh, and I totally forgot to mention because I always forget when we get into these. Thank you, Sammy, for sponsoring the review. Sammy! Uh, but Sammy sponsored this thing uh, while we're doing a live stream. And just thank you to the community in general. Because uh, the, really the only reason that we exist is fan funding. That's it. Um, I'd say like the income that we make on this is like 80% is fan funded at this point. Because nobody's making money on ads on YouTube right now. Nobody. I mean, I've seen channels that are four times my size. And they're like, oh, we're like, we're literally having to like maybe get a job or something. I was like, what the <laughs> fuck? Like, that's so weird. Uh, but either way... Thank you for watching. Follow me and Chuck on social media. Link down below. Only follow mine, though, if uh, you want to get angry. See you soon. Bye. What? In between. He might He might end this quick. Oh, no. White privilege is beating up Blumgum. Oh, no. No. Oh, white privilege eliminates Blumgum. White privilege eliminates Blumgum. What in the fuck? What in the fuck? Oh, Blumgum's got to be pissed. Yeah!